Hello all. In this video, we will be discussing about aliases in Tableau. Now let's first understand what is aliases. So aliases are the alternate names of the members in a dimension. Now let's drag a dimension, for example, category to shelf. Now as you can see, the members of category dimension are furniture, office supplies and technology. Now if I want to rename those members in category dimension, let's say instead of furniture, I want to rename it as FURN, instead of office supplies, I want to rename it as OS and instead of technology, I want to rename it as TECH. Now in other words, I'm trying to show the alternate names of the members in category dimension. So for that, what we need to do is we need to create an allies. Now let's see how to create an allies. So to create an allies, you need to right click on that particular dimension in the data pane. Then you'll have this allies option. So click on that and over here we can rename it. So I will let it as fun. If you are in for furniture or office supplies, I will mention it as OS and for technology. I will mention it as TECH. Now, once we are done, we will click on OK button. As you can see, it has been changed to FURN, OS, and Tech. So, in this way, we can create aliases in a dimension. Now, let's see how to apply aliases in case of sets. Now, we know what is a set. Set is a subset of dimension. So, first, what we'll do is we'll create a set on market. And over here, I will just select APAC and EU. And I'll give the name as APAC comma EU set. Now the requirement is that, okay, when I drag the set, we all know that it shows as in and out. Wherever I drag, be it in the shelf or in the masker, it will show as in and out. And um, what I need to do is, instead of showing as in out, I want to rename it as uh, let's say for in, I want to rename it, uh, it to APAC and EU and, inst uh, and instead of out, I want to rename it to other markets or rest of the markets because we know that in is nothing but the members of the set. In, the, in this case, it will be APAC and EU and out is nothing but the members which are not present in the set. So that means the other markets except APAC and EU. So let's drag this set. As you can see, it is showing as in now. Now, instead of showing as in now, I want to change it to APAC EU and rest of the markets respectively. Now for that also, I need to do edit analysis. So in that case, what we need to do is once you have dragged it to shelf, right click on that and there will be an option called edit analysis. As you can see. So here we can change the analysis name. So for in, I will give it as APAC and EU and for out, I will mention it as rest of the markets. I'll click on OK and I will drag one of the major, let's say sales. Now, if I want to apply uh, color, so we can drag the set to color. As you can see for APAC and EU, it is showing as blue color and for rest of the market it is showing as gray color. And if you want to change the color, just click on this color icon, edit colors, select the data item. Let's say for APAC, I want to show it as green and for rest of the markets, let's say I want to show it as um, red color and click on apply and OK. So in this way, we can apply aliases in sets. So that's it from this video. Thanks everyone.